I gotta just keep perfect blocking. Oh, the larva's fighting it too. No, 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 not the, not the, not the, not the, not the buttons, not the buttons. Salutations and good morrow, everyone, and welcome back to another Grounded Woe Mode video, where today we are hopping in, and we are going to be going through and taking on some spiders, and possibly the Broodmother. Awesome. But, in the last episode, I said I wanted to do the Broodmother, but I ran into a couple of challenges. First things first, I don't have the Broodmother BLT recipe. I gotta run over there and get it. And, on the way, I also was thinking about this. I haven't even fought a wolf spider yet in woe why am i gonna go fight a brood mother without mithridism i'm gonna die anyway so i'm gonna go over we're gonna get the brood mother blt recipe and i'm gonna try to fight a wolf spider on my way over there and see if i can take it down without dying i know their attack moves pretty well and i'm hoping that i don't die immediately i have a couple smoothies on me i got 15 of them on me and i think we're gonna be able to pull this off so let's head over let's get into the game of grounded here we're gonna run over here first things first make sure i don't have the quickness on i have cardio fan on that's fine actually you know what let's throw the quickness on for now while i run over towards where there is the wolf spiders and then i'll just make sure i take it off before i start fighting them because otherwise, I'm just going to end up dying anyway, and that's no fun at all. So, let's get on over here. Now, I think the one that I'm going to try to fight is the one that is underneath the leaves that's over here. It's not a bad spot to fight a wolf spider. It's not a terrible spot. It's not the best spot, but it's not a terrible spot. And I think I'll be able to pull it off if I can get over there. I really should have Parry Master on for this. Not cardio fan. I can deal with the fact that I'm not going to be able to get as many swings in. But I would love to have that extra perfect block ability. That, I think, is what I need. Okay. So, I'm right over here now. Let me grab this soda drop that's right here. This is going to give me that food and water. You guys know what I'm talking about. Look at all of them. Look at all of them. All right, Pete. Let's, uh, let's do it right now. Cardio, er, natural explorer off. Perfect block on. All right, should be right over here somewhere. Should be. Ooh, I never grabbed the Rotten Larva Blade either. I should have grabbed that, especially with me having the Berry Charm. I bet you that that would have been a powerful thing against this spider over here. Oh, well, we're going to have to just get used to it. Well, it is right, right over here. I could grab it really quick. Nah, we'll get another time. I'll remember it's over here at some point. We'll give it a try. Okay. So, I need to get right over here. Larva, 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 larva. Okay, I got one. Oop, there was that stun. Nice. I wanted to hold on to that a little bit for the, uh... Oh, we'll see you later then. Bye! Grab that larva spike. Get and eat it for making... Oh, are you are you coming back for some more or what? All right, do I have any healing bandages? No, but I do have a mac and bees. I'm gonna go ahead and eat the mac and bees. A little chewy, but not bad. All right. All right. All right. You know what? I'm even. I, I'm healing up all the way, and my statuses are set right. Parrymaster Meat Shield. All right. Here we go. We're gonna give it a try. If I can't even do this, there's no point in even fighting the Broodmother. I'm just saying that right now. Focus time, Sim. Oh, I got poison crap. I gotta just keep perfect blocking. Oh, the larva's fighting it too. No, 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 not the, not the, not the, not the, not the buttons, not the buttons, not the buttons, not the buttons. That's what got me with the stupid larva, the, oh, crap. Larva, why are you here? Thank you for killing that for me. I, I really appreciate that. Now, if you could just come right over here for me, so we're not fighting the grass blades, that would be awesome. Gotcha.
The one problem with this that I know I'm gonna run into is that Broodmother Poison is so much worse. It's so much worse, but we did it. All right. The first one's always the worst, right? First one on roll mode, always the worst, but there it is, Mithridism. Why is the first one always the worst? Because you don't have the poison resistance, but now we got it. All right, nice, good, okay. That makes me feel a lot more comfortable. All right, seven smoothies. That's plenty to get through the hedge. I'm just gonna go ahead and run through the hedge now. Um, I'm actually really happy with that. I didn't like that I was poisoned. All the ads did not help at all. The ads are going to suck when I'm in the Broodmother fight as well. Thankfully, the Broodmother is even more predictable with its with its attacks. So I'll be able to get those pretty easy. It's all the spiderlings that I'm worried about. They're going to chew my armor apart. Not to mention, I still have to make a Broodmother BLT, let alone get the recipe, which means I need bombardier parts, thistle eagles, and ladybug parts. But I think I actually have all those back at home. Maybe even on me. No, not on me, but definitely back at home. If I was to get some spider sacks, too, I probably could get... Well, I'd probably end up getting a ladybug head, not ladybug parts. And I'd probably get a bombardier beetle's explosion sack. Well, well, I really should have brought a... A, uh... Tufty with me. That makes this more tricky, doesn't it? Okay. Drink that up. I'm good. I'm good. I'm out. I'm out, little Spider-Man. I'm out. Okay. Now, thankfully, the way to the uh, the Broodmother BLT recipe isn't that bad. To be honest, the way to the Broodmother BLT recipe is fairly easy, especially for getting a boss recipe. But I guess it's fine that it's that easy, because at the end of the day, you have to go through and fight the boss at the end of it anyway. So... Oh well. I really- I, I, I'm, I can't put the quickness on. I want to, but I can't, because if I put the quickness on, what I've noticed is because I'm so used to this speed in the game, like, I am beyond used to this speed in the game. I could run everything in this game at this speed in the game, right? Because it's just what I'm used to playing at. But when I throw the quickness on, I'm moving, that little movement boost that I'm getting throws me off completely. It makes it so I could definitely die. That is a terrible tuft. That is a horrible tuft. That is a garbage tuft. The only thing I could use that for is a last minute ditch effort. Stupid itchy nose, by the way. A last-minute ditch effort trying not to die right before I hit the ground to take away a little bit of... of, uh... pain when I hit the ground. Can't get me up here, little guys. <laughs> Sim's on this stick, and you can't get me. Okay. Zip on in here. Drop off right here. Oh, nice. This is not as quick as maybe like going through the base itself, but I'm going to take it anyway because of this milk molar. And I really need more mutations. I was sitting here thinking about it in between episodes, and I was like, man, I need some more mutations. It would make this whole playthrough that much better if I had some more mutations. You know what? I'm just going to tank the damage. I'm going to tank it. I don't care because I need to go over here. Oh, I could go get the golden milk molar that's over here too if I play my cards right. I think I can, actually. I think I'm going to do that. Because if I play my cards right, there's a golden milk molar that's in here. There's actually a couple milk molars that are over here. Okay. Right up over here. Right back in here. And there we go. And I got the scabby, too. All right. No mosquitoes. No mosquitoes. I need to go back into the hedge. I need to grab that milk molar. Alright. We have the Broodmother BLT recipe now. We have the... The parts to make it. I would really, really, really like to get more parts, though. Like, more, uh... 
more mutations before doing this. This is quite the dangerous thing I'm about to embark on doing. And... Uh, I don't know. I'm just... I'm throwing ideas back and forth right now on if I really want to go through and do all of that right away right now. Like, I know I said in the last one I was going to fight the Broodmother, and I'm not chickening out in any sense of the line, right? I'm fine with fighting the Broodmother. I don't care. What I'm not fine with is dying over and over and over and over and over again when I could have gone through and prevented it by doing a little bit of extra. We've already done that dying over and 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 over thing in this in this series. You guys watch me get absolutely decimated by the infected ladybug that's at the bottom of the haze base. So it's like, do I really want to do that again? I mean, obviously, yes, but do I really want to go through and do that all again? Especially when I'm all I'm missing is the fighting of some wolf spiders to get Mithridism 3, and then I'm, like, golden at that point? I mean, that wolf spider didn't take me that long to take down, right? And yet I'm still afraid of mosquitoes. I was gonna say, this thing's almost broken, what am I gonna do? Repair it? I have repair glue now. I'll just repair it. Just stay over there. Stay happy over there. You want nothing to do with me? I want nothing to do with you. Okay, cool. The little orb weaver that was walking over there. I really didn't want to fight him, but I could. I could. No. No, don't need to. Not needed. Not needed at all. I'm trying to think of, like, if there's anything else over here that I need while running over here. And I mean, like, these dewdrops that are here, right? I'm gonna grab all these. That I can. I didn't really need the dewdrops right now. So it's just, like, grab as many as I can. This area is prime for dewdrops, by the way. Did I go up on the picnic table in the last episode and not get the other part of coup de grass? Did I really not do that? I was right. I, I know it was the bees and stuff were all around there, but really, I mean, I could have. Dang it. Sometimes I make myself shake my head because I'm like, you know, I I want to do all these things in the game and then I, I do silly things that I completely forget to do them. You know what else I could technically do that's not that hard? Is I technically could run all the way over to the upper yard. I could run all the way over through everything to where Thor's pendant is, and I could grab Thor's pendant right away. Like, right away. I could grab it right now. Um, not in this episode. Definitely not in this one. Maybe in the next one. We'll run over there and we'll grab it. I'm slowly realizing, though, that... Dang it, I hate that I said that now. Because in the last one, I was all excited about going and fighting the Broodmother, but it's just not going to happen. Maybe in the next one. No. I could set up for the next one. I could set up for the next one. I only have seven smoothies. I, I definitely don't think that's going to be enough heals. I do have some grub goo back at the house, though. Hmm. If I just got more... If I just got more muscle sprouts. Because I, I, I think if I had like 10, I probably could pull it off. Although if I had like a spicy antlion greatsword, I could definitely pull it off. Hey, while I'm here, I mean, I just picked it up. I might as well. There we go. Spicy antlion greatsword would definitely make that whole battle go way faster. And I know she's going to have more health and stuff because we're on woe mode. So, this whole episode is like me trying to psych myself up, but also, you know, not get myself too excited, if you know what I mean. 
I got six muscle sprouts left and 15 grub sludge. And I don't have everything. I need ladybug parts. Crap. Well, ask and you will shall receive, apparently. Mirror you. Ow, I didn't block in time. I thought I was going to block in time, but I didn't. Ow. I didn't really want to use that much healing in this one. Stop healing yourself. And just take it. Alright, give me two. Yes. Nice, 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 nice. Very, 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 very nice. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Ooh, wrong thing. You. Broodmother BLT recipe. Go. We're doing it. I don't even care. I'm gonna run over there. We're gonna- We're gonna at least be there. So in the next one, we have no choice. The next one, we have no choice. It's just gonna have to happen. What did I need for you to upgrade? Oh, I need supreme plates for you. Bah. You need level four. You need level- You need three. Which means I'm gonna have to repair you like this. The rest of those are good. This is trash. This needs to be repaired. And you put all this away that I can. Smoothies. Smoothies, smoothies, smoothies. And healing bandages, if I can. Put you away. What can I use to make smoothies? Definitely those. Um. Um. In here, maybe? Those, I don't care. These, I don't care. So I'll grab two stacks of ten of those. I don't care. Mite fuzz, I don't care. For now. Let's make these ones first. Nice. There we go with that. The prob- the only issue that I'm foreseeing right now that I'm gonna have is the fact that I'm gonna be running in here to fight the Broodmother and all of her little kin without really a way to deal with all of the ads. That's my- and I'm- I know I'm not gonna be able to heal myself out of the ads power. I have some gas arrows, but I don't think those are going to be enough for me to take down the, the Broodmother. And I can't put on the, the uh, Toxicology Badge, because if I put on the Toxicology Badge, one hit and I'm dead. Because the poison would just destroy me. And I can't really put on the Entomologist Badge either, because once again, one hit and I'd be dead. So, I'm kind of stuck right now. I guess I could put on the defense badge and lower my attack damage. Yeah, see, parry heal, compliance badge, that's the one. Toxicology badge, I don't think I have the entomologist badge yet, do I? Yeah, I do. Attack plus, no, no imperfect block, yeah, no, so that's out. So it's got to be the defense badge if I'm going to have any of them on. It's just going to have to be what what's there. I could use some spicy arrows. If I use my bow, I could use some spicy arrows to shoot her in the beginning. My bow doesn't do very much damage, but the spicy would, would help. If I had more... I would eat this if I had more mutation slots. But I think I only have the one milk molar, right? I only have the one, right? Yeah, I only have the one, so... Max resource stack size, I guess. And then nothing in here is going to help me right now. Okay. Alright. Let me sleep. If I can. Nope, I can't sleep till 22. Okay. Then we're just going to prep instead. I need a couple of these...
Very good. I don't know why I'm even bringing this over here, other than it's a great place to respawn if I need it. I'm not, I'm not even gonna bring it with me. So I have 12 beefy smoothies and eight regular smoothies. And two fiber bandages. Well. I'm gonna have to just make it work. That's gonna have to be my thing. I'm just gonna have to make it work. I'm not chickening out of a fight. I'm going in and drinking this dew drop and getting my way over there. Let's throw the quickness on. We gotta get over there quick, so I don't wanna sit here and play little runaround games. Parry Master's gonna not be on because I have to have Mithridism on. Crap. I really, really, really wish I had two more milk molars. It's all right. It's all right. I'm going to make it work. Like I said, this is all about just F it, let's do it. That's what we're doing right now. And I, I know we can do it. I think we can do it. Yeah, I know we can do it. Bombardier Beetle, watch out. Sure, Bombardier Beetle, down there. It's not harming anything, Pete. I promise you're going to be okay. I should have done the mixer first. Smart Sim would have done the mixer first. Dang it. <laughs> I'm just thinking about it now, like... Uh, if I would have done the mixer, too... I have a cat hair in my nose. Uh, I think if I would have done the mixer... It really wouldn't have done anything for me, though. Now that I'm... Th no, it wouldn't have, It's not defense. Dang it. Um, I think right now my brain's just trying to think up anything that it can. But th there's there's nothing there's nothing stopping us from the fact right now is the fact we're about to go fight this. You could try to hype yourself up. We'll give it a couple tries, and if we die, we die, and we just load our game, and that'll be that. And we'll go and we'll have to fight more mosquitoes and we'll have to get more, or not mosquitoes. I said mosquitoes because there's a mosquito right over there. Uh, I'll have to fight more wolf spiders and, uh, you know, go through and get the the badge for the whatever it's called. Thor's Trinket. Because it's so easy to get. So, yeah, I'll have to do that instead. You know, I do like how easy they made Thor's Trinket to get. Thor's Trinket's so helpful, and they didn't put it somewhere where it's difficult. Now, here's the tricky part about saying something like that. Every time I have said, this is good, or this is easy, or anything like that, it gets nerfed or changed. Every time, which is really frustrating. So if that happens, I'm sorry in advance. But, you know, that's that's just my luck. Y'all notice anything that's missing? No? No, how are we gonna summon the broodmother? Ooh, you suck. How are we gonna summon the broodmother? Alright. No, you know what? I'm not gonna do this to you guys. I'm gonna do this instead. You guys gotta wait one day. One day. I'm gonna run back. I'm gonna grab the broodmother BLT. Alright? And I'm gonna come back here. I'm not gonna change anything. I'm gonna have this exact gear. I'm not changing a thing. I'm going to have this gear. No more smoothies. Nothing else. I'm just going to go grab the Broodmother BLT. And I'm going to come back to the spot where I'm standing right here at the end of this zip line. And this is going to be where we pick up tomorrow's episode. And we are going to start with fighting the Broodmother in the next episode. That is what we are going to do. So, thank you everybody so much for watching this one. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, hit that like button for me. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. And as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.